What we're proposing is that the town of Hampton take over the responsibility, the maintenance of the sidewalks, when and only if there are new sidewalks constructed and ADA compliant. Exposure to ADA. I feel the strongest all of you in terms of that is a liability. But right now, the town of Hampton has the responsibility of 29 miles of sidewalk. What we're suggesting is add two more miles to that, because that's the distance that we're talking about in terms of the maintaining of the sidewalks that we're proposing. Two more miles. And those two more miles would become ADA compliant before taking over the responsibility. I was, con I was quoted recently, and it might have disturbed some of you, about the word compromise, and how I, how I said that, you know, we need to compromise on this issue. And I can assure you, as a representative of the town, appointed by the selectmen, but representing the town of Hampton, that I, as one commissioner, have had a lot of discussions with the state. Mr. Watson will attest that I have been talking to him for close to two years now with what if, what if that, what if this. So as a commissioner, I took my job serious to look at both sides of the issue. And I can assure you that if there was a way that I could have talked the Department of Transportation into making an exception in this particular case, I would have tried, and, and I did. But if you put that aside for a minute, that compromise, well, okay, if they're saying, no, we can't take the sidewalk maintenance, DOT can't take it, but what can we offer the town of Hampton in lieu of? Let me just name a couple of them. First of all, DOT has been supportive from day one when we started talking about the reconstruction of, of Ocean Boulevard, from day one. The town of Hampton and DOT and the Beach Commission were hand in hand in hand in every effort in looking at funds to reconstruct Ocean Boulevard. So they have been our partner from day one. The grant that they're administering for us right now is all free of charge. It's not costing the grant money, it's not costing the beach uh, commission or anybody. Their administration of this grant is all free of charge. So there's no cost. And as you already heard, both from the senator and from, from Bill, if we can get past this maintenance agreement, the secretary, I mean, I'm sorry, the commissioner, Bill's office, the Beach Commission, everybody will work hard to make sure that compromises of how we can help, whether or not it's pushing the snow on the road and having DOT take the snow away, whatever that case might be. So, you know, when, when you look at compromise, to me, those are compromises. So in closing, <clears throat> 